What is poppin', ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Mikey JTV and the mother place to be. And today, got a little bit of a news video. Today, we've got um some resin news that many people have been asking for. Um, among other things that are coming in the um November 11th update in 1.1. Um, the first thing is they they attack the resin issue right away. Um, the question is, I never have enough original resin. What makes it difficult, which makes it difficult to compete various daily tasks and the weekly battle pass mission? Not really a question, but okay. <laughs> Their answer to that is in one, version 1.1, we have decreased the original resin requirement and battle pass weekly missions from 1600 to 1200, which is apps, which is really great. It, it really is great. And furthermore, travelers will be able to store up to a maximum of 160 original resin increased from the current limit of 120. So that means we get an extra 40 resin. Not 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 a bad start. If I if I have to say so myself, that's not a bad start. Now, going forward, there are obviously more things that they could do to, you know, circumvent the problem with the resin. We could get more fragile resin, which boosts resin uh, up to you know 60 and we could also get you know um they could decrease the cost of the resin for you know daily things like fighting the regis veins and the hypostasis and all those kind of things we definitely want to keep the pressure going for these resin changes definitely want to keep the pressure going let's see what else they have besides the resin um I want, to I want to change the key bindings and controller setup. We are in process of uh, we are in the process of developing a key bindings controller setup function, which will uh, go live in version 1.1. We are firing all on all cylinders to complete the remaining functionality, which will become available to players in a later version. So really, not much on that. Um, I wish there were more ways to filter artifacts. This is a big one too, because I would like to filter my artifacts by either attack or damage and stuff like that so that would be great if they could add that and they said they were going to be adding that in uh 1.1 so that's pretty good uh traversing the game world is time consuming i want to be able to set my own teleport waypoints for areas that i frequently visit i think um they've already stated that they're going to have a um a portable um teleport system so that's 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 going to be cool and it's and it's actually coming out in 1.1 so we don't have to wait until december well Till, till February for that. So that's that's pretty good. You see, it's annoying to have to select equipped artifacts and weapons to find out which character has them. This is also a big problem. I go through that a lot, um, changing up my builds and all that kind of stuff. So it's great that they're actually, um, it says small character avatars will appear next to icons. Cool, 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 cool. So it's, it's, it's cool that they'll be able to, they're, they're addressing that as well. Um, like I say, this is, really just the beginning you know beginning launches are always you know rough for these types of gotcha games um epic 7 definitely had a i always i always refer to epic 7 i don't know why it just seems like it's the things that are happening between genshin and epic 7 are are pretty much mirrored um there was a big stamina issue in epic 7 there they've addressed it it's not really all that bad anymore honestly like you know, once you get to end game, it kind of just tears down. But I digress. Um, <laughs> uh, let me see. What else are they doing? Uh, developer Q&A. How is damage calculated? I have more than uh, one shield. Which shield sustains damage first? All that. Eh, we really don't need to go into all that. But <laughs> wait, how is this a and a You just asked for the damage and it's only one question. But anyway, I just wanted to pop in. And, you know, say something about the resin because that's the hot topic for Genshin Impact right now is the resin and the amount of things that you can do once all the in-game content is over and done with. But um, let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. If you guys think this is just a, a, a good step in the right direction. Is it too much? Is it not enough? Let me know down in the comment section below. And I thank you guys for coming through subscribing. Don't forget to like the video, comment and subscribe. It's me, your boy, Mikey JTV, in the mother of the place. Me as always, guys. Peace.